So now let's see how we can work around with the disk space setting and indexing settings inside of Thunderbird. So to do that, I'm going to go around over here onto the uh, tools menu and I'm going to go around under settings and I'm going to go around and scroll down over here. So once you go around and scroll down, you can see that disk space is an option right here. So as you keep on receiving emails, your disk might get more full and more full over time. So you can see that right now, the disk space 33.9 megabytes is being used right now but over time it might be more than gbs of space and if you want to go ahead and clear the uh, 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 space out right here then you can simply click on clear now and the cache memory uh, taken by the mails um, of Thunderbird will be cleared out so it'll still be available in the email cloud but it'll be cleared out from the disk space that means if you were to open up an email it'll have to download it into the cache again and then open the mail so you can also clear the uh, cache on shutdown so let's say for example you don't want any temporary files and so forth you want Thunderbird to simply clear out the caches and all the temporary memory, then you can simply um, uh, clear out, uh, clear, clear it out while uh, Thunderbird actually exists. Uh, exists. Uh, um, uh, so what you can also do is you can override the automatic cache management and let's say for example, utilize only certain space of cache right here. Let's say for example, I can do 300 MB, then um, uh, above that won't be saved at all. You can also compact all the folders when uh, it is saved over 20 MB in total, as you can see right here. So you can set the limit right here and you can also ask every time before compa uh, compacting as well. Apart from that, you got the indexing, which allows you to go around and search for emails. And this is handy to, handy to have it then on because if you want to quickly search emails then it does not need to go through all the files but just the index so um, this does take a bit of space um, and some processing power but it's worth it to have it on otherwise it will have to search through all the emails when you search them um, out each time you can also go around and choose let's say for example for new accounts you can choose inbox or mail dir according to how you want as well but you can leave it to default if you don't know uh, what what they are um uh, what, um uh, don't know the specifics of why you have to use them you can also use like hardware acceleration when available which actually helps you manage your mails and says them easier as well and this is how you can go ahead and then manage out your disk space and indexing inside of thunderbird so hope you guys learn something as always and as always please like comment share and subscribe